One of the most well-known anime subgenres is romance. The best thing about romantic movies is that you can watch them with your loved ones. For everyone who enjoys romantic fiction or wants to start, here are the best 10 anime series to watch. Let's get started now without any further explanation. Number 10 Touch The romantic animation, Touch, from the 1980s still meets today's requirement. The anime has a little bit of a slice-of-life feel, with romance taking center stage. It was adapted from Mitsuru Adaki's manga series of the same name. The plot revolves around two twin brothers, Tatsuya and Kazuya Uesugi, and their adolescent childhood friend, Minami Asakura. The tale concentrates mostly around baseball, since Kazuya is his team's top pitcher. Despite the fact that Tatsuya may be more gifted than Kazuya, he is a slacker who has spent his whole life letting Kazuya take center stage. Last but not least, the Uesugi boy's childhood buddy and neighbor is Minami. She is forced to date one of the Uesugi brothers at her school on a regular basis. Any fan of the romance genre must see this bittersweet tale of two brothers and their childhood buddy, who serves as the center of their society. Number 9. Wotakoi, Love is Hard for an Otaku Wotakoi is a singular romantic anime that approaches the show's central theme from a little unorthodox perspective. Two couples' stories are followed in the TV show. The first pair consists of Hirotaka Nifuji, an old buddy from Momos's middle school who is also a hidden otaku and enjoys playing video games, and Narumi Momos, a woman who works in an office but is a secret otaku. The second pair consists of Juro Kabakura, a gamer and anime fan known for his great taste in nearly every medium, and Hanako Koyanagi, a stage theater nerd who enjoys reading manga and watching anime as well as boys love. Number 8. The Rose of Versailles Another masterpiece that has stood the test of time is The Rose of Versailles, one of the most well-known anime of the 1970s and one of the most significant influences on the romance subgenre in anime. With certain historical connections, the anime is set during the golden age of the French Revolution in the 1970s. The anime centers on Oscar Franchot's a noblewoman who was raised by her father as a son because she was his only child. Andre Grandier, her butler and a friend from childhood who used to train Oscar in the disciplines of fencing and equestrian, welcomes Oscar. While it appears impossible, the fundamental romantic connection of the story centers on Oscar and Andre. Number 7. Sakura so no pet na kanojo. The major themes of Sakura so number pet na kanojo are character development and dealing with challenges in life. The anime centers on Sorata Kanda, a second year high school student who resides in the Sakura so dorm. Due to their eccentricities and special abilities, the dorm students are specifically known as difficulty students. The story picks up the pace when another talented individual named Mashiro Shina moves into the Sakurasou dormitory. Sorata becomes her caretaker, eventually leading to develop complex feelings for Mashiro. Number 6. Or Monogatory Or Monogatory 
is a romantic animation with a dash of humor that focuses on the characters' special and endearing connection and how they overcome obstacles to understand each other's opposites. The main character of the anime is Takeo Gouda, a muscular high school student who is frequently misunderstood while having a kind and open heart that is overlooked due to his appearance. Takeo protects Rinko Yamato from a harasser in the beginning of the anime, and later he develops feelings for her. Number 5. Kara Kano Yukino Miyazawa, a popular and bright student at her school, is the main character of the anime. Yukino's encounter with her smart and appealing classmate Soichiro Arima, who learns about her true nature that no one else knows, alters her life forever. This bittersweet and complicated relationship anime, which focuses on the connection between Yukino and Soichiro, is a must-watch. Number 4. My Little Monster My Little Monster is often regarded as the ideal romantic anime adaptation of the manga. It was animated by base at Studio Brain and broadcast from October to December 2012. The tale centers around a girl named Shizuku Mizutani, a high school student who is only focused in getting good marks until she meets her classmate Haru Yoshida. Their friendship evolves into something neither Haru nor Shizuki expected as they learn about one another's differences and hobbies. Number 3. Orange Even though Orange is one of the finest romantic anime to come out in a while, it doesn't get much attention. Orange addresses people's past life regrets, the strength of love, and their potential for atonement. Naho Takamiya, the protagonist of the series, is said to get messages from her future self. Naho's future self informs her of important life events that are coming up as well as the choices she must make in order to alter the future. The plot of Orange centers on Naho's friendship with Kakeru Naruse, a new transfer student who is hiding something from everyone. Number 2. Kimi ne Tadok An endearing romantic animation with a touch of humor is Kimi ne Tadok. The narrative centers on Koronu Masawakoi, a quiet and misunderstood high school student who frequently receives comparisons to the ghost from the film, The Ring, owing to their striking similarity and struggles to establish friends at her school. The story significantly changes when Koronuma encounters Shota Kazuhaya, the most popular kid at her school. Kazuhaya helps Koronuma come out of her shell and sees her without the ridiculous similarity to that specific ghost. Eventually, their friendship steadily turns into a romance, and because of their reserved characteristics, they become the center of attention at their school. This has a number of issues and misconceptions attached to it. Are they going to be able to solve such issues? Number 1. Nana Nana is famous for being a romantic anime with a bit of drama. The diverse cast, depth, and original plot development are themes that set it apart from other romance anime and give it maturity. The story of Nana centers on two girls with the names Nana Osaki and Nana Komatsu, who have quite different personalities. They initially connected on a train to Tokyo since their names and destinations were a coincidence. As soon as they exit the train in Tokyo, they begin to hang out together and form a complicated relationship that is difficult to describe. The show examines the complicated issues of love and follows each character's path independently, since they each face unique challenges and have unique connections with their loved ones. Will they be able to escape Tokyo at rush hour? 
There are many better romantic anime than this. If there are any top anime that I miss, please let me know in the comments.